Hey, what's up everyone? This might be an ME for some people. Now, the person that pointed this out, their YouTube name is Data Junkie. So, shout out to them and thank you for sharing this with me. They, uh, they thanked me for giving them the shout out in, the, in my previous video. And they stated that apparently this is an ME. This is a shift, a quantum shift, a reality shift, Mandela effect, whatever you want to call it. Where the Schumann, the Schumann residence, many Mandela affected people have not heard of it, but but yeah, more than a year. now and the uh, ear ringing and all of that that is quite common and now that I see this it feels like it's coming to me it's coming back to me so I get these situations where things seem like the the recollection you know suddenly comes to me when it's like boom it comes back to me even though it's like it shouldn't be there but yet there's the memory but anyway the Schumann resonance are Resonances are a set of spectrum peaks in the extremely low frequency portion of the Earth's electromagnetic field spectrum. Schumann resonances are global electromagnetic resonances generated and excited by lightning discharges in the, in the cavity formed by the Earth's surface and the ionosphere. So, this is something that has been widely apparently talked about for a good while now, and many people in the Mandela Effect community including myself, experience these frequencies and hear things at a higher rate. By the way, thank you all for sharing with me. Thank you all for sharing in uh, sharing with me in my previous videos, sharing your own personal experiences, sharing uh, just various things, your theories, your ideas. And I post my videos to let everyone know that you're not alone. And... I want to spread the truth out there. I want to share the truth. And that's that's what I plan to do with my channel. So feel free to like this video and let me know if you've experienced this phenomenon. Let me know if uh Oh by the way, big shout out to uh Almadia78, I think that's her name. She's uh she spoke again. I haven't gotten to hear from her in a while and it was good to hear from her again because uh she was one of the very first people that subscribed to me. She and uh, Always Thinking, but I'm not sure if, if you're listening, Always Thinking, let me know you're doing well, because uh, I haven't heard from you in a while, and I hope you're doing well. I hope many of you are doing well. Um, uh, there are many individuals, it's been a little while since I've heard from Rowdy One, and um, I'm trying to think of so many names. There are so many names that have, of people that have followed me since, that, uh, let's see... Flynn Ryder, uh, I haven't heard from you in a while, I don't I don't think, and uh, I hope you're doing well. Tom Heakin, I hope Tom Heakin, if I'm pronouncing your name correctly, I hope you're doing well. I haven't heard from you in a while as well. So if you're watching this video and you uh, and you happen to you just happen to stumble or you happen to uh, stumble upon this video again, let me know you're doing well. I would like to hear from you all again, just to know that you're doing well. Uh, let's see, I think there was another uh, another YouTuber. Let's see, I emailed her, and I've emailed several people, and they haven't email, emailed me in a while. It's been a little while since they've emailed me. Yeah, it's been a little while since they've emailed me, some of them, and uh, I've been meaning to get back to several of them, and uh, have not gotten to get back to all of them yet. And um, I need to message them back and email them. Um, so I thank you all I wish I could remember all of the names let's see uh, I'm trying to remember that person's name but I can't remember them I can't remember the name I hate that I hate when that happens um, I think they had the, wor had the word star in their name and uh, there are so many people that have spoken to me and shared with their journey shared in their journey with me and it's it's awesome it really is. And I just wanted to state that 
If you'd like to donate, feel free to do so. It would help out greatly. And um, to my PayPal, just donate below if you'd like to do that. And share your own personal experiences with me. With me, uh, with I mean, share them with me. That means a lot as well. And there are several names that I would like to remember. I'd like to remember all of you, <laughs> all of your names. <laughs> um, thank you all so much. If you'd like a shout out, feel free to ask, and I'll give you a shout out. But everything, everything is vibrational energy, frequencies, energy, uh, just. beyond what people what everyone on a moment to moment basis think of, thinks about what society considers the norm the normal things are a lot more complex and simple but yet simply complex I guess you might say if you get what I mean if you catch my drift here <laughs> but anyway I just want to spread some positivity and love if you've heard of the Schumann Resonance, if you experienced it, let me know. Is it a Mandela effect for you that it's been going on in the ME community? Is that an ME? Is that an ME that the that the community's been talking about it for so long for you? So uh, give me give me your thoughts. I also uh, suddenly, while I was just sitting on the couch, got these three marks on my leg, on my right leg, just popped up like three, ding ding ding, just like uh, like you'd been stuck with a needle three different times. Now it's swollen. It itched, and then it swole up into a lump under there. I keep getting these microchip sized, these RFID chip sized lumps and marks, and I don't like that. And it just appeared. Who knows, maybe time froze and something froze and I was injected with something or something did something. Things can do things beyond what people understand, I'll tell you. But give your thoughts on the Schumann Resonance. Peace, much love. I've got so many different things to share, and I've written several of them down. Well, I haven't written them down, but I put them down in the uh, Inkpad Notepad account, and I'll make a video on them. I'm using my tablet right now. I have to keep it plugged up pretty much 24-7 before it'll work. But finally, I have these, uh, this wire, these, all these uh, wireless chargers that I can use that that I got for good deals, like two dollars or as a free item at this Give Me a Five place. So I have plenty of wireless chargers to lay my phone on, and uh, or a charger pad that I just kind of lay it on there or a stand charger stand it's really cool and uh, since I got that finally got that little card thing or whatever that you put on the back of the battery in the phone and you just kind of place it on there and it makes your phone ad adapt it's an adapter that makes your phone wirelessly charge that's some of the best that's the best thing they ever came up with was wireless charging one of the best things because that really helps out a lot anyway uh I went off into another topic didn't I but anyway, I can I guess I can never talk enough to you all. <laughs> That's a good thing. Um, anyway, peace and much love. God bless you all. I hope to speak with all of you again very soon. Share your own experiences and feel free to donate. It would help out a lot. And feel free to like, subscribe, share this video, share your experiences, and post in the comments. Peace. Bye.